wish I could be with you right now. Every morning, every afternoon, every hour, I want to be with you. It don't matter if we go to the park or watch a movie, I just want to be with you. I love everything about you from your own school tennis shoes to the way you move when you're dancing with me. Do you remember our first kiss? It wasn't long enough, all of our sweet conversations. It wasn't long enough when it's time for me to leave. It's so hard to say goodbye. I never want to say goodbye. I never want to say goodbye one day. <laughs> we'll make love finally. I'll be that's how y'all feeling. I love you. I love you. I love you. A gift from Virgo. Let's see if this reading say that. I can love you. Too late, I already love you. I love you, I love you. I feel like y'all are in love. I feel like y'all are in love. Today is the day of Venus, honey. I feel like y'all are in love. That song is a gift from Virgo by Beyonce. One of my favorite songs. And I don't know. I was just drawing. I was getting actually getting ready to do Aries uh, reading. I got interrupted with that. And anytime like I get interrupted or the energy shifts and it's just like a bad time to do that particular sign, then I'll just go on to the next one and go back later at a different time. <laughs> so the song, A Gift from Virgo, I was playing it earlier today and I was like, them damn Virgos. <laughs> it wasn't long enough when it's time for me to leave. It's so hard to say goodbye. I never want to say goodbye. I never want to say goodbye. One day. Let's see what messages we got for the Virgo. Y'all check out the description box below. I got a lot of goodies in there for y'all. I got a 40% off sale on the website today only. All right. If you want to be entered in, um, I'm picking five lucky winners at the end of this month. You have to shop from the website or book a personal reading from me. That way I have your email address and all the information I need to reach out to you. I'm going to be picking five people. You can choose to get a personal reading from me for free, or you can get a free product from the website. So go ahead and shop, guys. It's 40% off the entire website today using code 1111 at checkout. You're going to get a 40% discount. That is today only, guys. So take advantage of, take advantage of that 40%, y'all. All right, so let's talk. Let's see what messages we have for my... Virgos. I hope it's good. We got the judgment. Judgment. Ooh, the chariot. Four of cups and the high priestess. You're not sure how to move forward with this. You're not sure uh, how to or if you want to make a final decision about a situation. We got the King of Wands. You could be dealing with the Fire Sign. Three of Pentacles. Eight of Swords. 
the uh, nine of swords, ten of swords, the lovers, eight of pentacles, nine of cups, king of cups, and the hangman. I was in love with the Sagittarius. I'm just getting like some of y'all dealing with the Sagittarius. <laughs> Some of y'all are dealing with a Sagittarius, Leo, or an Aries. They have fire all up and through their chart. Why is the King of Wands here? The Hermit, you guys, it's energy. So you could be carrying this King of Wands energy. Four of Swords. Some of y'all are being kind of lazy, having like a lazy day. Um, you're kind of like to yourself, okay? Some of y'all are working, like coming up with ideas with this three of pentacles. I see y'all all up in y'all head. See, yeah, you're trying to manifest. I feel like a lot of y'all are manifesting. Look, you're trying to manifest. We got the Empress and the Ten of Pentacles, honey. This is growth and expansion. This is having, coming up with ideas to get that back up, okay? Especially with the Page of Pentacles here, Six of Pentacles. Yes, lots of new, fresh ideas, okay? Ways to get that back. So this is what I feel like you're taking time, you're resting, because you're getting ready to manifest, okay? The Eight of Swords here, I feel like this is, this is you being in your head, okay? Five of Pentacles. Some of y'all are trying to come out of a financial hiccup situation, okay? Two of Swords. I feel like y'all feel like I don't have time to waste. There we go again. She pops out again. The Empress and the Ten of Pentacles. This could be some baby mother, baby father situation with this Empress here, okay? And it's Ten of Pentacles. This could be a mother, okay? So you could possibly be in mommy or daddy mode, okay? Nine of Swords here at the bottom of the deck and the Three of Swords. Some of y'all are worried, possibly, like I said, some of y'all, this is a baby mother, baby father thing, with the emperor here. Some of y'all are worried about a third party. Or, you, yeah, see a third party. Queen of Wands. Queen of Wands and the Three of Swords is not a good combination together. I'm just going to tell you that. So, some of y'all are worried that there's someone else in the picture. Okay? But I feel like, overall, if you focus, if you put your focus on what you're trying to manifest and what you want, I feel like you'll manifest quickly. Don't let this situation distract you. Okay, now we got the Ten of Swords here in the past. The Seven of Wands, okay? Yeah, see, you're. I feel like you were very uninterested um, in a situation. Could be a Sagittarius. You know, you just wasn't feeling the vibes. I don't feel like you was really feeling the vibes in a situation. Yeah. You don't want to you don't want to lash out Ten of Swords and the Seven of Wands and the Five of Pentacles. I'm sorry, Five of Wands. You don't want to lash out on this person. So you may be deciding to take a different route and move on or let the situation go and call it even. But I still feel like you worry about it. Now we got the lovers moving ahead. The lovers is Gemini energy, but we got the Five of Cups, okay? So I don't want you guys to be regretting this a uh, dilemma or a situation later because it looks like that's what's coming up okay could be dealing with the sagittarius you're trying to keep your attention see look we got the four of pentacles the six of wands king of pentacles okay i feel like you are holding your attention somewhere where it doesn't necessarily need to be because i feel like if you put your energy here on what you're working on and what you could build It'll be more beneficial to you. Okay, so it looks like you you could possibly be regretting a decision that something turned out the way that it did. Okay, or there was some type of conflict. You could be trying to keep the attention on you, possibly involving a king of pentacles. Um, you're just trying to keep the attention on you, okay, because I feel like there's this toxic cycle, some toxic love cycle, or somebody got some toxic ways that's so addicting, 
that, you know, it's just like, look at this. When I said addicting, here we go. Going around and around and around and around. Like, this is just, if you put this focus on your pentacle and what you are working on and building, it'll be more beneficial for you. It's going to be more beneficial. Yep. So, it looks like you are you are progressing and you're trying to move forward. Okay. We got the Queen of Cups and the Fool and the Six of Swords. So, I'm definitely getting, okay, maybe you're trying to become more emotionally balanced. I'm also seeing as well, too, with the Fool, like there's this uh, new beginning, okay, but you're going to have to let something go. Something's going to have to be released. You're going to have to move on from something in order to get this new beginning. Like, get a fresh, complete fresh start. We got the strength card, okay? You're going to have to be brave and strong, okay? And make a decision. Make some type of decision that's going to be best for you. Okay? So, let's see how this person views you. We got the nine of cups. They're getting their wish fulfillment, okay? They're getting their desires, they're getting, they want, they want attention too. They want to see how you're going to respond. They want to see, they're, they're watching you. They're watching you. They are watching you. And they, they want attention as well too. They want the attention on them and you want the attention on you. So how's that going to work? <laughs> how is that going to work? Why are they spying? Two of wands. They want to see what you're going to do. Okay, they want to see what your next move is going to be. Are you going to keep it cool or what you going to do? Like, how you going to move? I keep picking up Sagittarius' energy. Okay, somebody was saying that they're ready. You could have told this person that you want to talk about something new. You want to see something new. You want to see new opportunities come in. You want to see new blessings rain down. You want to see something beneficial, something new. Okay, King of Cups. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio's energy in the sun. So you're you're hoping that this person gives you a more emotional fulfillment. Like, it's more positive. Give you a more positive answer. Give you a more positive vibe, okay? Because I'm getting like, you want clarity from this person. You want truth. You want this person to be real, straight up with you. King of Swords, Ace of Swords. You want this person to be, take uh, ownership with this emperor, Okay, you want them to take accountability. You want them to take care of responsibilities. You've been waiting on some type of promise or commitment or for them to straighten up and get on a straight and narrow, okay? Or you're waiting for them to tell you about something that happened or what was going on in the past that you're curious about. So we got the hangman as the outcome, all right? So judge me. You're still waiting for a, a final decision. You're waiting on this person to make a decision. Why aren't you making a decision? I don't feel like you trust this person, okay? Especially with the Nine of Wands and the Seven of Swords. That definitely lets me know that you already feel like this person is tricky, okay? You already feel like this person is tricky. So you could be out, you know, trying to make new connections, new friends. Uh, but you're waiting on this person to make up their mind. The Emperor. Like I said, this person gives me, is giving me real big boss Big boss energies. Like, they giving me, like, baby mother, baby father energy, husband, wife energy. Um, but I'm getting, like, a counterpart. Like, this is a very significant uh, person in your life. Okay? So, why is the emperor here? This is somebody that you're extremely connected to. Like, you really love. You really care about this person. Okay, Knight of Pentacles and the Page of Pentacles. Okay, I'm getting that day. I feel like you're waiting for this person to give you an offer, but the offer is taking so long to get to you. Um, and But the offer is going to be a... The Knight of Pentacles offer is slow to get to you, but it's going to be well thought out. It's going to be um, something that they took their time on because they want to make sure that they made the right decision. Okay, so let me get a little bit more. Why is the Page of Pentacles here? The Fool. Could be dealing with the Aries and the Star, Aquarius, and the Four of Wands. So you could be hoping that this person comes home. Maybe this person is, is at a distance from you. Um, maybe you're hoping that this person moves in 
with you. Maybe you're hoping that this person gives you a ring, give you something solid, give you a, a commitment, a move into a new home, a new city. But I feel like you want some type of commitment, real commitment from this person. You want something real and authentic from this person. All right, so that's what I got for my Virgos. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. All right, I'm going to chat with y'all later. Be sure to check out the website. 40% off today, guys. Y'all got until 8 a.m. tomorrow morning to get the 40% off. Use code 1111. So it's code C-O-D-E 1111 um, all together. All the letters are uppercase. As well, guys, if you want to book a personal, all of that information is in the drop box below. I'm going to chat with y'all later. Ciao for now.